and welcome to a new video and today we are taking a look at four different ships of Quasi Europe, a French cruise operator with mostly river cruise ships and they had a porte ouverte which means open day so four of their ships were accessible for everyone and you could take a look around and we're starting with the Lafayette, a rather small river cruise ship. Here you just saw the restaurant and here you can see a single cabin and we can also take a look at the other cabins later on as well. The ship is 90 meters long, 10 meters wide, was renovated in 2014 and can take up to 80 passengers and it is sailing on Rhine, Neckar, Main and Mosel and it is a so-called five anchors ship which is equivalent to five stars which means the ship is very modern as you can see completely renovated and I really like those beds facing the window so you can just lay down in bed and enjoy the beautiful landscape of the rivers. Also the bathroom is big and nice and here we can see a cabin on the lower deck also with big panoramic windows so also the cabins on the lower deck are very nice as the ship only has two decks it has panoramic windows also on the lower deck. Here we go up to the upper deck again and here we can take a look at the lobby and a small look into the lounge but as the ship was pretty crowded as it was an open day I can only show you very few bits of the public areas and here we can go to the sun deck to end our small tour around this ship. It is not a full ship tour, of course, maybe enough to get a first idea of what the ships of Croisi Europe look like and what is the difference between a five anchor and a four anchor ship. So this was the ship Lafayette, a smaller ship with a five anchors, a five star ship. And now we continue on to our next ship. That is the Beethoven. And the Beethoven is much bigger. She is 110 meters long, 11 meters wide, was built in 2004, renovated in 2010 and can take up to 180 passengers. And this ship also has three decks, so it is much bigger. Here we are on the lowest deck of the ship and still we have rather big windows, which is very unusual for river cruise ships. Usually on the lowest deck like this, there are just tiny windows at the top but not big picture windows like here. In the front we have the restaurant, but it was in use, so unfortunately I cannot show it to you. And then we can go up to the reception area. Like we can see here, and we have the cabins on the middle deck. You see the window is almost the same size, just slightly bigger and it's an opening a window. At least a small bit of it can be opened. And here we can take a look at the bathroom. And as you can see, the ship is less modern than the Lafayette. And this is because this is a four anchor ship. And here you just saw a cabin on the upper deck with the French balcony. And now we can go all the way to the back where we have a small lounge. Not the main lounge, the main lounge is on the middle deck in the front. But was also in use and crowded, so I couldn't show it to you. But here we can take a short look at the small lounge at the back of the ship, which can be, for example, used as a library or calm alternative to the main lounge. And that's it for the second ship. We are continuing on the Gérard Schmitter. Here we can also see the lounge in the back. And here we can see a cabin on deck three. And here you can clearly see the difference because this is a five star ship again five anchor ship so it is looking more modern. Also on this ship I unfortunately cannot show you the lounge or the restaurant. Here we can take a look at the atrium and that's it for this ship. And the fourth ship that we're gonna take a short look at is the Madeleine which is a peniche, a small kennel boat. Only 40 meters long, 5 meters and 70 wide and it just has space for 24 passengers and it can sail on very very small kennels that are not accessible for regular cruise ships. And that's it for this short video about the Porte Ouverte of Croisi Europe and obviously I'm hoping to one day make a cruise with Croisi Europe to show you a bit more of their ships and what they are doing. But that's it for this video. I hope it was interesting for you. Here you can see when the next video will be uploaded and the name of the song. As always, I'd like to say thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please consider to comment, like, subscribe or share the video link. And I hope to see you in my next video.